Today we are especially blessed to welcome Vong Thuy Vu to begin her next step on her journey of discernment. Her desire to enter the novitiate is both a gift to our congregation and to the order of preachers and a reminder of God's fidelity to each of us on our own journeys. Fong, this is a very happy day for you and for us. As you take this next step in your discernment and become a canonical novice, the opening words of today's reading are put on. And in Greek, the word is enduo. And it means not just to put on, but to sink into clothing. So then, Fong, this year especially, and every year hence, put on, sink in to Christ's heartfelt compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience, bearing with one another and forgiving others as Christ has forgiven you. Above all else, Fong, let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. Make your home there. Treasure your time in prayer and contemplation. Hear God's voice calling you to bring the mercy and the love and the forgiveness of God to self and to others. Do not be afraid to face any challenges that you encounter. Why? Because you are the Lord's beloved. And as our song this morning said, God has chosen you, and God intends to use you to bring God's love to those you serve your whole life long. Fong, we too will do our part to live out the virtues expressed in Colossians. We owe this to you as your companions on the journey. Together, we will lift our combined voices to spread the gospel of peace globally and locally. And now I invite you, Fong, to come up to the stage. Fong, for the past months, you have lived among us, sharing the life and the mission of the Dominican Sisters of Peace as you discern God's call to you. Is it your desire to continue in the discernment process by becoming a novice in our congregation? It is my desire. Is it your desire to focus during this time on deepening your relationship with God, as well as your understanding of the vows and the mission of our congregation. It is my desire. Is it your desire to experience the breadth of the Dominican lifestyle by participating fully in the collaborative Dominican novitiate this coming year? It is my desire. Sisters and associates, led by the Spirit, Fong has expressed her desire to continue in the discernment process by becoming a novice with the Dominican Sisters of Peace. Will you support her by your prayer and example as she takes this next step in her journey? Yes. God has called Fong to explore God's desire for her life. We welcome you, Fong, as a novice, and send you forth to listen to God's living word and to join your voice with ours as you praise, bless, and preach the gospel. We thank those who have journeyed with Fong as her mentors during candidacy. Carol Herman, 
Mary Vaughn, Kathy Arnold, as well as her local community with whom she has been living and who have provided welcome and have demonstrated by their lives the richness of the Dominican tradition. We are most grateful for your generosity. Well, we now entrust the continuation of your formation to Sister Pat Duell, Coordinator of Formation for our congregation, and soon to the co-directors of the Collaborative Dominican Novitiate, Sisters Lorraine Raum and Kathy Arnold. May you and they be richly blessed in the year ahead. Fong, receive these constitutions through which we seek to articulate our identity, mission, and lifestyle as Dominican Sisters of Peace. Receive to this book, the new wine of Dominican spirituality, celebrating the traditions at the heart of Dominican life. May you continue to be inspired by our brother Dominic and the whole Dominican family. This assembly reminds us to lift every voice as we continue to be peace, build peace, preach peace in the service of the global community. This wooden cross will remind you of our commitments during your novitiate and beyond. And so I invite us all now to extend our hands over Fong in blessing as we sing. Dominican sisters and associates of peace go forth, sent by God as disciples of Jesus and daughters and sons of Dominic, to do as our sister Catherine proclaimed, to speak the truth in a million voices. It is silence that kills. Amen. Amen. Amen.